All right, guys, I just want to say thank you so much for clicking on another video. If you're enjoying the series, make sure you hit the like, sub, and share as well. And um, let's get it, man. Fight night. Let's go. And coming up next, it's a UFC welterweight division matchup. Well, this is about as decorated a kickboxer as has come into this division in some time, DC. And if we get a kickboxing match tonight, he ain't losing. He is a championship-level kickboxer, a guy that can stand in the pocket and trade and kick and punch with anyone. He's constantly throwing things from as close as you can get. He's comfortable throwing leg kicks. He will drive knees into your body, but it's the aggressiveness and the ability and willingness to stand in the pocket and trade that makes him truly, truly special. I think that is what separates kickboxers, the high level yeah. from everyone else. He understands distance as well as any striker in this division. Of course, that is a byproduct of a lifetime of repetitions in the kickboxing space. All right, here he is, Jorge Gamebred Masvidal, longtime representative of American Top Team. You know how happy it would make Dan Lambert if Masvidal could finally break through and win a UFC championship. He's as close to that level as he's been in his UFC career. As he's ever been. He's finally on the cusp of earning what so many people have hoped for for him. But that doesn't happen by accident. The reason he's this close now is because of the commitment that he has made to mixed martial arts. Commitment that he has made to evolving his game, going up to 170 pounds, and also using everything that he has in order to get to where he wants to be. Before, there might have been distractions. Now, Jorge Masvidal is solely focused on becoming a UFC champion. Left his family to go compete in a reality show outside of the United and States. Gave him a, yeah, <laughs> one, it gave him a lot of focus and direction, and he has put all of that to good use here in the UFC. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a kickboxer holding a professional record of nine wins, no losses. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Miami, Florida, Hurricane. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of 37 wins, 15 losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Miami, Florida, Jorge Gamebred Masvidal. And with the attributes, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. All right, Herb Dean, third man in the octagon for this one. Ready. All right, here we go with round one. His knockout streak really has been the stuff of legend, knocking out contenders left and right. He's won his last three, all of them by flush knockout. Shape. Watch the shot. Whoa! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. All right, side control now. We'll see if he can advance position. Back to his feet. Oh, man, this guy kicks like a mule. So hard. He kicks so hard every time you can see him drive his chest into his opponent. Look at him drive his shin into the oh. body. He needs to oh. 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 oh, looks like he's got a couple hooks in here, DC. And defensively, you better be careful. Big ball for punch land. Now he gets back to range. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Well, for years, Tyron Woodley gets set. Oh, working. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, he might be out. Every time these guys come together, man, you just hear the punches and everything landing. Both, both very 
powerful, very, very explosive. Man, he is so sound defensively. Nice job to raise the guard there. It's the relaxation that allows him to see things coming and block most of the strikes that are coming at him. Nice loop and punch. Well, the Octagon, not a great place to be when you're looking for a rest or a stool. His stamina has been a huge issue tonight. It's abandoned him, but he did it. He tried. He you shot that, baby. Come on, bruh. Yeah, you predicted it right. First round knockout, bro. I'm a goat, man. I'm a goat, man. That's all I got to say. I'm a goat, man. Make sure you hit that like button. That's all I got to say. On hard. Replays now. Certainly a lot for all replay guys to work with in the truck. This was a clinic tonight in terms of mixed martial arts acumen in every round. A full-on display of all of his skills. He did everything in this championship winning performance. He used his wrestling. He used his elbows. He used his pace and pressure to I ain't even put the perk on yet. It's not even on, see yo. It's not even on. I ain't put the perk on. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 11 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Hurricane. Well, there will be no shutting that smile off tonight. The celebration is on as he gets a huge win by knockout tonight. I got to think there are a few better feelings in the world than walking into an octagon and Candidly knocking another man out there. Yeah, you shut a person's lights off, man. There's nothing yeah. like it. Now, I understand. I got to get my takedown defense, but I put all the perks on takedown. Like grappling sure defense and all that. Get it done, and he did exactly Let's that. Let's get wrestlers. Congrats. Nah, I'm going to fight him. I'm going to fight some wrestlers, bro. I'm going to fight him. Nah, I ain't going to run from that smoke. <clears throat> let me, uh, let me sign this. I could probably, I could probably edit these videos like in 30 minutes. And I could come back, come back live. If y'all want to watch it live, I have it live, but I'm going to cut these videos up real quick, and then I'll be right back. Just want to say thank you so much for clicking on the video, and I appreciate y'all, man. The playlist, y'all check that out. Hit the like button on everything, and see you, man. Peace.